Hey YouTube, what is going on? It's Briss, and today I have a kind of a rant video for you guys. And the topic for this video is pay to win games and premium servers. Basically the same thing. Uh, pay to win games are kind of like those Facebook games where you pay to buy coins and it speeds up all your stuff. And premium servers of TF2 are where the specific group or company asks for you to pay them to get special bonuses. So pretty much, I was just playing, uh, I felt like playing some TF2 this morning, so I wanted to play some Doomsday. I hadn't played Doomsday since the release, pretty much, because all the hype went down and everybody realized that it was such a shit map and such a bad game mode. So, um, everybody stopped playing it, except for a few servers. This was one of the few servers that I could find with people in it. Um, and most of the people in it were probably people who had never played the game before. So I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll join it. Not knowing that this was a premium server. It's a nightteam.com server, so if you don't want to join a premium server, don't join them. Um, I've seen other rants about them on Reddit and stuff. Specifically this one. And what they do is they ask you for $3.99 in euros. Um, I think a euro is like 1.3 American dollars, um, so it'd be like 1.35 Canadian dollars, but, uh, not 100% sure. And what this does is it gives you a premium account, and when you have premium, you can do a whole bunch of stuff. You can turn yourself into a robot. You can paint your items for free, uh, within their servers, but that's not what people pay a premium for. People pay so they can move medic speed as soldier, like I am right now. People pay it so they can rocket jump ridiculously, like I can, while I was using this premium trial. So pretty much I typed exclamation mark premium and got it for 15 minutes. Um, it was just ridiculous. There's other people doing it as well, using their daily trial for 15 minutes. And see, here's one. They have ghosts. The ghost effects when they're using it so hard to hit because he's moving like as a demo man he's probably moving close to scout speed uh, and there go there goes the rocket jump again uh, I pretty much hit the skybox I wasn't expecting that so I kind of messed up my jump um, but uh, it makes it makes the game really really easy and also with pay to win as you'll see right here when I die you get instant respawn you can move around before the round starts and a whole bunch of other ridiculous stuff. I can just rocket jump over to their spawn before most of them even leave their spawn. Get some damage out on the spy, but I start missing my shots. Um, so I just dip. I I run faster than all of them though, so they can't catch me. I had like five health, grab this and get a random crocket. I don't know if premium affects damage or stuff like that, maybe just like a 10% damage boost. I wasn't really paying attention to that sort of stuff though, but I was too rocketing everything. Um, which, you, which I normally don't do on uh, when I'm playing with the direct hit. Usually it takes four rockets to kill a heavy, but I guess that's from pretty long range. Um, and here's another guy using premium. He's moving super fast. He's moving the same speed as I am, believe it or not. And he is not the greatest. He's trying to mark a garden just because he has this um, improved rocket jumping thing, but he's he's pretty bad at it. You can see this is the type of person that would get lured into paying for this. The kid that doesn't have that much time in TF2, and he begs his parents to pay these people for premium. Anyways, what do you guys think of pay-to-win games and premium servers? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.